Welcome to my channel. Let's look at another topic called regression analysis in business statistics. Yeah. Regression. Regression. This model assumes a linear relationship between the dependent variable and the independent variable. It shows the relationship between the variables, but this one is a linear relationship. Regression is mainly about the line. So it shows a linear relationship between the dependent variables and the independent variables. We said variables are items that are under study, the things that are given in the question or the things that you're focusing on. Yeah, variables are the items under study, and these can be sales, advertising expenditure, output, cost of production, attendance, performance, etc., age, Anything that is under study or anything that changes with time and space, it is a variable. And the types of variables under regression analysis, we have the dependent variable and then the independent variable. Yeah, the dependent variable, it is that variable that is dependent on the independent variable. It is influenced by the independent variable. And the independent variable is that variable that is not influenced or it is not affected by the dependent variable. Yeah. Then the models of regression, we have two models. We have simple linear regression model. And this one assesses the relationship between one dependent and one independent variable. For example, sales and advertising like one one. One dependent and one independent. And then the multilinear regression model it assesses the relationship between one independent variable and several dependent variables. That is multi-regression. One independent and several dependent. For simple, it is one independent and one dependent. Let's look at the regression formula. The regression line of y on x is calculated using the formula y is equal to a plus bx whereby we calculate for b using the formula summation xy minus summation x times summation y out of n summation x squared minus into bracket summation x squared. And that is how we calculate for b. And we calculate for a using the formula y bar minus bx bar. Yeah, we shall see it in details in the next video when we are having an example about regression. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share with your friends. Let's catch up in my next video.